Hey yo, what's up guys? How we doing tonight? Welcome in everybody. We are going to get ready for a workout here. Little legs, little core. Um, hopefully a fairly quick workout tonight uh, and everything. Um, anybody who's been following me a little bit, uh, you know that I'm not a big fan of legs and core, but I need to start doing if I'm going to push this uh, weight loss fitness journey to the next level and I definitely got to hit that up. So with that being said, I've already did my attribution. You can find all the stuff that you want uh, that goes into my stream production right there. Real quick, if you want, you can find all my socials in one convenient spot. If you're a Discord user, feel free to hop on in. Links are right there. Um, with that being said, though, I am going to jump us on over to DroidCam. I got you set up. We're going to go in. We're going to get our uh, walk in on the elliptical, get our five to ten minutes in. Probably going to push like seven. Um, get the legs loosened up. And then we will get into our workout for this evening. So, bear with me while I switch over to switch cams and get all set up in the other room. I'll be right back.
Now we're unmuted. There we go. Now we are unmuted. Okay, that does seem to be working the way it's supposed to. Yep. Yep, I was muted. I forgot I had it muted on the actual mic itself. But we got it. Hey, if if you don't have a stream where your mic is muted, if you don't have a stream while your mic is muted, you ain't a streamer. But uh, we got her all figured out there. And I need to go into here. Got to bring that down some. There we go. That seems to help, I think. So, now, I need to go vertical cam. I need to, I don't know if this is going to work. All right. Uh, start virtual camera. Could just be gone. See why I bug judo? Hey, absolutely. Listen, it uh, it it definitely happens. Okay, I got that pretty faint. You probably can't hear it on this side anymore, but. That's all right. Okay, so I want to go live over here. Choose live match, music, learn fitness and sports, do it yourself, food. Uh, I guess we're just doing chat and interview. Post workout chat. Okay. That should work on that side of it, I think. All right. So, those of you, I want to go this way. What did I do? Okay. But um, I probably better. I'm gonna update my title over here. Or uh, game is just chatting, and that should be good to go. All right. So again, I thought um, again the legs and core. I, I've been extremely lazy with that lately. Um, I thought that workout went fairly well, for the most part. Um. I, I was kind of feeling it a little bit, not going to lie, but the, um, uh, I, I thought it was, I thought it was a good session for a first, uh, legs and core workout in a very long time, because that's extremely where I was extremely, extremely lazy at. So. I'm going to try to keep an eye out what's going on here, but I think we should be live here over on TikTok. Hopefully, uh, my, my mic is going through over there. Um, I don't know if anybody's actually popping in over there and looking or not, but hopefully it is. Uh, hopefully, hopefully you can hear me, hear me over there. Channy, what's up, buddy? How are you? Thanks for the rose. It is. Okay, thank you. I appreciate that, buddy. What are you doing? You better be getting to bed. You got school in the morning. By the way, congrats on your touchdown the other night and two-point conversion. You had some speed going there for you. Um, but uh, like I said, we just got done with the legs and core workout, and now we're just kind of cooling down, chatting a little bit. Um, probably till about 11.30. Another rose. I don't even know what roses mean, man. But I appreciate you, buddy. I appreciate you. What? I don't even know. I don't even know what that. I don't know what that symbol even is. Sending lots of things. What is that thing? A dolphin? 
And well, I guess it does say when it pops up on the screen. But uh but yeah, like I said, chaos. I, I was I was doing six workouts a week. Um I'm I'm I kind of changed it up because I've been doing that for a long time. Um probably about eight weeks, so it was kind of chi- kind of time to change change it up a little bit. And uh just do something a little bit different and everything. So um, and, and I think that's a, when, in when, like I said, once you're getting into working out, um, it, uh, after so long, you do kind of have to change it up slightly a little bit. Um, just to, just to work out to him. I'll be here if you keep streaming the same time. Well, I pray it pretty much it is because by the time I get done with everything that I have to do, it's usually, usually around 9 PM my time, which I think we determined last night, you're an hour behind. Um, but, uh, definitely, um, definitely will be around. So, um, I said, I'm going to try to figure out how I want to do this. Um, I don't know if I'm going to stream every single workout, but I do want to do about three nights a week. It's 11 for you. Yes. It's 11 Oh six right now. Yep. But um, for those of you who are peeking in here on TikTok, uh, last night I went live for about five minutes just to see how it would work. Um, so I want to try it again now that I have the TikTok studio going, um, and hopefully this uh, hopefully this works out. I'm a lot. I, I'd love to be able to stream directly from mobile, but I, I don't have that uh, capability yet. But uh, maybe someday soon. So hopefully this this studio on the desktop works out well for us um for me for us it's all we're, we're one community uh, hopefully you know that's the whole point of me trying to do this but um you know as as i continue doing these workouts um I, like i said i'd like to do them on tiktok as well right now the issue with it is is with me using my phone as the uh Hi Molly. Why why is uh oh it been paused over here somehow, right? Did I lose did I lag out somewhere? Am I lagging out here on TikTok? I don't know. My live studio seems to be working, but watching the live feed on this, it may take a while to load this live, try reloading or adjusting the video quality. Okay. Um now viewing an original all right hopefully it's working but hi molly how are you doing um but like i said my issue with doing the workout streams is if i go and use the camera the way i do when i work out um over on tiktok my camera ends up going sideways and nobody wants to watch somebody stream or work out in that form so then i kind of have to go back to this way vertically um so i got to make some adjustments on that and the other issue I have is I don't have my microphone that I use while I'm working out. Um, doesn't TikTok, it's a weird, weird on for cams. Yeah, I've kind of noticed that. I've been trying to, trying to figure that out a little bit. Um, but I won't have a mic for the TikTok streams either unless I'm at my desktop. So... I got a lot of I got a lot of things I got to figure out, or if I can get a, I guess Bluetooth microphone that I can, that would be long enough to reach from the computer into the other room and stuff. But uh, like I said, I I'd like to really kind of try to put. I mean, I, I do try to put content on TikTok, YouTube, obviously live streaming here is on Twitch. I did try to simulcast and use Kick and and YouTube for that, but um, Twitch is just the easiest for me. Kick, I just don't have enough of a following. I, I'd love to get affiliated over there, but uh, it uh, you know it, it it's difficult. I mean, I don't I don't have a massive community here on Twitch, so you know when Kick started, a lot of those smaller streamers 
Um, we can get you affiliate on kick easy. Um, but, uh, uh, it is the same name on kick. Yeah, it is the same name on kick. Um, pretty much it is, it's the same across all the platforms, TikTok, kick, Twitch, um, YouTube, Twitter, Lord Galvatron. Galvatron, thank you so much for the raid, man. How was your stream? Give you a little shout out here. Uh, why didn't that work out? Yeah, it's LRD Galvatron. How are you doing? How was your stream? Um, what were what were you streaming tonight? What were you gaming? First time chatter, Nesley. How are you doing? Welcome in. Welcome in from the Galvatron raid. How are we doing? Thank you so much for the follow i appreciate you thank you thank you nestle i hope you're having a good one thank you thank you you were uh mortal kombat one mortal kombat one nice 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 um but how, how did mortal kombat go tonight uh i was streaming mouse keyboard mortal kombat and complaining a lot, but I still like the game. Hey, you know, it's that's that's just that's that's just something that you do, right? That's something that you do. Um, I think so. But uh, again, everybody high on TikTok. How are you? We're just chatting post workout. Um, but uh, go Niners! Yes, fellow Niner, a fellow Niner fan. Let's go. You're too much of a competitor. Hey, that's that's just the nature of it, right? Um, there's nothing wrong with being an, you know, a competitor and being competitive at everything. Um, there's nothing wrong with that. Uh, yeah, just gotta keep it to a a certain extent, I suppose. And go Cubs. Are you a Cubs fan as well, by chance, or are you just just trying to butter me up here? But, hey, by the way, let's go Padres. Did we just become best friends? Perhaps we did. Perhaps, you know what? I should probably have a blurp for that. I should probably have a blurp or sound alert for that. But, Galvatron, let's go Padres. Beat the Dodgers, right? That's, 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 that's it right now. Oaksy's team's out, which I really can't root for the Brewers anyways, being a Cubs fan. But, I think... I think we got to go. I think we got to root for Padres here on out, right? Padres all the way. Plus, I know Judo's a Padres fan too. Um, you know, I mean, I mean, unless you're a Yankees fan, nobody wants the Yankees when the Astros got knocked out. I guess, I guess the next the next team outside of the Padres would have to be the the Tigers, right? I mean, if for some reason, if for some, if, if the Dodgers happen to, you know, knock out the Padres, I think the team everyone would want to root for would probably be the Tigers, right? Tigers or Royals? Why are you a Niners fan? So, um, to be honest with you, when I was young, growing up, my dad was a Niners fan. Um, I was born in 84. My dad was a Niners fan during the 80s, obviously, when the Niners had their heyday. Um, so, he was a Niners fan, and just by being my father's son, I adopted that as well. Absolutely. Um, Niners in the 80s, you know, four Super Bowls. Um but uh, but but that's how that's that's why I'm a Niners fan. Um, always stuck with them, for the most part. Um, uh, Niners and Cubs, you know, those are the, my dad's two favorite teams to follow and root for, and that just kind of stuck with me. Um, you live less than a mile from Levi Stadium. That is awesome. That is awesome. I would love to make it out there someday and see a game i'd love to take my kids um at least my sons i don't know if my daughter would enjoy it 
I'd love to take my boys. Um, I think they would enjoy that. I've only been to one NFL game in my entire life, and that's when the Rams were still in St. Louis. Um, and they played the Niners. It it we went. It was a New Year's. I think it was like a New Year's game. <clears throat> Come for the Super Bowl. I don't know. I don't know if I can. I don't, that's that's a that would be a. Uh, that would be a task. That would be, it would be awesome. Not gonna lie, that would be awesome. Super Bowl, Levi Stadium, watch the Niners finally get over that hump, hopefully. But uh, Oaksy, thanks for liking the live over here on TikTok. Appreciate that, brother. Appreciate you. Um, I just don't know if I could afford that. Maybe, maybe I'll get lucky. Maybe I can fill out one of those surveys that the that the Niners. Um, I live in, in rural Illinois. I'm, I'm probably, I'm 90 miles from Chicago. Um, I live in the country, cornfields, bean fields, uh, very rural. Um, I, I tend to associate it with Chicago, but, um, it, it's rural Illinois. Um, I, I'm actually closer to Iowa than I am, probably am Chicago. Easy there, buddy. Green Bay going to hoist the Lombardi this year. Ah, we'll see about that, Oaksy. We'll see about that. Chicago is your second home. I do enjoy going to Chicago. I really do. Um, there is some, you know, obviously you want to make sure you're in the correct, you know, the right places. Uh, I mean, anywhere, anywhere in the world, there's good places, there's bad places. But um, I do, I, I enjoy it. My wife and I, when we go up there, over there, up there. Well, I was going to call it more up there, but it's more directly east of me, not so much north. But um, it, there, there's, there can be some fun times. Uh, I, I, we definitely enjoy it. Definitely enjoy it. Uh, three. And to be honest, they're 15, 13, and almost 11. So... Yeah. Yep. Yep. Two boys and a girl. Daughter's the oldest. Fun times for sure. Can see the bean. But uh. But yeah. Hey, uh, Oaksy. Hey, you have a good night, man. Uh, get some good rest. I hope you have a great weekend. Um, hopefully the if you plan on getting the bike out, I hope it's uh a good weekend for riding. I know it's gonna start getting colder up in your area. I have a girl who was four and a boy who was three. But, uh, but yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it, enjoy it because, um, in the blink of an eye, they're going to be 14 and 13 before you know it. I mean, it's, it's, it's gone by, gone by quick, gone by quick. Or eight. Yes. Or, or eight. I mean, chaos i mean you're you're in a blink of an eye it's going to be 18 and and it's going to be definitely going to be uh oldest uh how old is my oldest daughter uh my oldest is fit yeah she's 15 my oldest thought joined all right so i forgot like my daughter was supposed to have a party here this weekend last weekend and I moved my guitar underneath my desk here, and I keep kicking the case. Thankfully, it's in its case. Um, not that I play it much or I'm even good with it, but it uh, probably doesn't belong where it is. Buenos dias, senor, to you, sir blood. How are you doing? Are you, are you home from work? Are you still at work? Are you just getting off work? But uh, like I said, for those of you who are viewing over on TikTok, last night I went live for about five minutes just to see how things would go. Um, I just got done with my workout here live on Twitch. So now we're just kind of chatting for a little bit. And I wanted to pull up TikTok and just kind of see how see how things see how things operate on this side. Nope, I'm still in hell. Uh we got a couple more hours yet. Anyways, just wanted to say hi to a fellow married 
uh, with kids, Niners, Cubs fan, new bestie, hey, new besties, new besties. Hey, no, I appreciate you, Nestle. You have a good night. Um, thank you for coming over in the raid. Um, but it, it's awesome that, uh, you know, what are the odds? You know, Niners fan, Cubs fan. Um, it's awesome. Was leg day fun? Um, I, I'll, I will say this, Galvatron. Um, I won't necessarily say that leg day was fun, but I'm glad I did it. And at AUD's baby. Yes. Yes. Kind of in that, um, you know, you know, uh, older, older millennial area, I guess is the way you would call it, you know, technically, you know, kind of a, a millennial, but, um, you know, right around, right on that Gen X millennial era in between. If you're kind of into all those terminologies, yeah, I would have been watching your YouTube vids support where I can. I appreciate you, man. I appreciate you. Uh, your leg day was yesterday. I'm dead. Um, but yes, that that's the one thing. And since I've really committed to to working out, um, that's that's kind of where I've been laziest is leg day and core. And now that I'm streaming these workouts. I think that's going to keep me accountable um, to doing that. Cause that's what, that's what's, that's what's going to get me to my next level and in, in reaching my goal of one weight loss while also um, maintaining and building the muscle mass that I want. I, you know, to, to have, have a lean frame. Uh, I'm going to go check in on the, the morons. All right, blood. I appreciate you. I appreciate you, man. Um, but uh, like I said, leg day, legs and core is where I've been the extreme laziest. And uh, th this way, streaming them, I can hold myself a bit more accountable and uh, and get them done. Because I used to have I used to have very strong legs, and now my legs are extremely weak. I mean, it's been twenty two years since I've committed to, you know training my legs regularly. Um, but like I said, I, I think it went fairly well. Um, I, I, I probably incorporate deadlift next time. Um, I, I didn't necessarily do deadlift. I did, um, I did, you know, Romanian deadlift, straight legged deadlift, stiff, you know, however, which, which are the same thing. Um, and then I uh, did a little bit of goblet squat and um, finished up with some leg extensions. Um, just, just something to kind of get them, get them going and moving and stuff. So, uh, I kind of, I really would like to know though, why does int my live chat show up in the TikTok studio app here? I mean, I guess it's a good thing that I had my tab pulled up here. So I can kind of see it uh, over over here. But um, but like I said, no, it was good. Um, it was something that I needed to do. That, that's what's going to get me to that next level of my goal of uh, trying to get trying to reach 185. Now, when I get to 185, I don't know what I'm going to do. Obviously, I want to ma maintain that a little bit. I don't know if I'm going to try to go lower. And maybe get to 180, maybe 175, um, or if just kind of try to maintain it. Uh, I am I am losing, I, I am losing, so I, I'm getting to a point where I know I'm going to plateau just based off my body frame, because um, I mean I don't want to lose muscle mass, um, but I, I want to burn this excess, you know, visceral fat that I have on my body. I mean, I'm, I am down 30 pounds and 23 of it has come since mid July. So, uh, I did have some dad bod going on. We'll, we'll put it at that, but now it's time to get back to, uh, um, you know, I, I have, I have a vision of how I want to look and, and I want to get there. Um, you know, I think I can do it. I feel like I can do it. I'm motivated. Um, you know, I, I really, really what I have to do is, um, 
really strict to the nutrition and I, and I don't do anything fancy. It's just, it's just, just, it's just maintaining, um, maintenancing, maintaining, tracking, tracking is the way I just want to say it, tracking my calories. Um, and, uh, and, and, you know, committing to consistently resistance training and, uh, you know, working out and stuff. I got the opposite issue. I'll take your extra food. Um, you know, so that, that that's just kind of thing. Like I said, it's, 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 I'm trying to get to what I feel is probably an adequate, uh, body weight for a 40 year old who's six foot one ish. Um, you know, I, I think I could look pretty lean at about 180. Um, you know, but, uh, again, um, you know, fat ways, you know, the, the, you know, if this is five pounds of muscle, you know, my tablet here is, man, I got that, uh, background and which, you know, my, my tablet is five pounds of, of fat. So. Um, there is, you know, there, there, there's, there's still more weight to come off. Um, while also, like I said, maintaining the, the bit of muscle mass that I have, um, like I said, I, I'm not trying to, I, I'm not trying to become a bodybuilder at all by any means, but I am trying to, you know, get myself into a, a healthy, healthy, healthy body weight. Um, so, but, uh, again, those of you over here on the TikTok, um, again, where we are post-workout right now, just kind of chatting a little bit, pretty much anything in general, um, you know, feel free. I try to keep an eye on the chat over here on the TikTok. Obviously I got Twitch going here, so. Um, but uh, welcome in everybody here on TikTok. And uh, like I said, that, that's, that's the thing. You know, I, I'm trying to, you know, I'm keeping my goals. You know, they call it a smart goal. Um, you know, make sure it's, you know, something that I can, you know, attain and, and get to and do it in a, you know, a smart goal. Um, you know and get to it and there's it and i've made, I've made great progress like i said since mid-july i'm down 23 pounds and, and i'm not doing anything special it's literally just you know i make my I, I do meal prep you know i do that you know i'm you know that's it's not something hard to do you know i i you know i i get the foods that i enjoy i just make sure that i'm eating them in a portion size that I want to, and then I just track what I'm calories and also keep the, uh, um, you know, in, in, and then I, you know, look at the macros where I'm trying to be. Um, a lot of it is cause I've done it on and off maybe. Um, and, and I just, you know, maybe because I've seen the progress over the past couple of months and I realize, Hey, this does work. Let's stick with it. And then it's, and then it becomes a, you know, it, you know, it becomes a, a habit and it's, it's easy to do. It's just, it's just part of the normal routine. Um, and it, it, t it takes a while. Just hire a cook. Um, I, I've act, I've tried some of those. Um, I, I have tried some of those prepared meals before i feel like i would meal prep more if i didn't travel so much for work and again that's that's hard too i mean when you're traveling constantly it is i mean when you're when you're constantly traveling it's hard to to do the meal prep thing um you know but it, it is i mean i mean it it's it's fairly easy for me um i spend <coughs> Sorry, guys. I spend one day, typically, you know, Sundays, and then I, I make meals for six days. Um, 
you know, I do allow myself, you know, a cheat meal. I mean, there's no reason not to. I mean, um, but again, I keep it to a meal. And then typically Sunday is a lighter it's pizza. Pizza is my kryptonite for sure. Pizza is definitely my kryptonite. But, um, you know, I, I do I keep it. I keep it simple. Again, Sundays, I'm usually um, not near as active as far as resistance training or doing a whole lot of cardio. So I, I do kind of back back down on on, you know, food that day I, I do try to make sure i do get enough nutrition in me to satisfy my needs um but then like i said monday through saturdays I, my meals are pretty much there um this week i did back down to only i'm only doing about two meals a week but i'm also doing about two protein shakes um you know to keep myself in a healthy calorie deficit uh, where i'm still getting the the macros that I feel that I should be should be should be consuming um in everything but uh like I said it, it's it's it it the the more you do it and you keep on it then it just becomes a normal part of your routine um and instead of it seem like a seem Instead of it seeming like it's a burden, it's just, it's normal yeah, every day. It's, it's just part of, it's just your normal routine, normal habit, and it's boom, boom, boom. And now, I am pretty simple when it comes to foods. I, you know, I don't need to, uh, I can... I can survive on eating pretty much the same things every day. I don't feel the need to change it up a whole lot. So that kind of helps make it that much easier for me to prep. Um, I think this last week has been one of the most consistent eatings I've had in a really long time. Very much used to skipping meals daily and even entire days. Uh, uh, those of you on Twitch, I apologize. Ads. But, um, I know it's, it's a pizza ad even super. That is super. That is awesome. That's what happens. You talk too much about pizza and you get, I, you know, it's my kryptonite. So why not? Wouldn't it, why wouldn't it be a pizza ad? Galvatron skip a lot of meals. Um, so I, I mean, and it, it gets costly when you're a, you know, like I probably should get, I should have bought a protein shake to have for after my workout tonight. Um, because I'm not going to be able to go up and turn the blender on here at midnight and make something. So, I mean, luckily I have something that I can eat that'll just get me a bit of protein. They are always listening. You're right. You're right. But, um, you know, there's, uh, a lot, uh, a lot, but again, I, I, I can, I get it. You're constantly traveling. It's hard to, it's hard to be able to meal prep because if you need to keep stuff refrigerated, you know, it, it's, it's impossible to do it. It is. Um, you know, Right, I got 40 seconds left in this ad. But um, again, nutrition is was the biggest key for me. 
I know Chipotle can be good when I need to eat, but it gets expensive. I, I mean, in anywhere in that industry right now, everything is expensive. Um, I think I have, well, I'm currently on TikTok, but I think I have a, uh, there was a video I seen of a guy, plus I got to buy the protein shake pre-made too. Right, right. Um, I've been able to maintain my current weight, but it's so hard to gain more. I'd love to put on like 10 pounds. Um, and honestly i will say and it's a pain in the butt but my fitness pal um that's that's the app i use for my tracking my calories and stuff um i just have the free version i i'm a tight ass and won't uh i'm not gonna buy the premium version at i don't know what it is i don't know if it's 15 dollars a month 20 dollars a month I'm not going to pay that, so I, but I can manually enter the foods that I do eat and track my calories, track my macros, um, but I mean, the biggest thing is with putting on weight, you want to add weight, you get, you got to make sure that you're uh, in a calorie surplus, so um, now I got a Fitbit tracker, it's not extremely accurate with tracking, you know, calories, uh, you know, steps and calories burned, but at least gives me a general idea. Um, you know, so I'm making sure that I am obviously burning more calories than I am, am consuming. That's also been part of how I've, you know, been able to, to lose 30 pounds since the beginning of the year. And 66% of that has been in the past couple of months. Um, and then obviously adding in the resistance training consistently has also helped add to that. Um, along with the, you know, bit of cardio that I do. Um, but uh, like I said, that, that's been the biggest part is, is the nutrition and calorie tracking. Um, haven't really done it since because I'm trying to push eating more without looking at much of the numbers and worrying about it. Um, and then, and then some of the thing is, is when you are lean, it, uh, I mean, you, you, what the, the more lean you are, your body is consistently burning calories just on its own naturally. I mean, that's just, that's just what the body does. I mean, when you, when you have, when you are lean, you're going to you're going to burn more calories, and it, it makes it harder. You know your metabolism's working at a much higher rate, um, and, and all that. So, and it can be. I mean, you, twenty twenty five years ago, I, I could eat seven thousand calories a day. It seemed like, and I wouldn't gain weight. Um, it would be interesting to see just how lean I am, but I feel like you burn calories just thinking about it. Like I said, as I've, you know, since I've been trying to learn about uh, strength training and conditioning, um, nutrition, um, you know, trying to, to learn more knowledge about it. Um, and that's, that, that's the thing is like the leaner your body is, the more your body burns calories just on its own. You know, it, it, it really does. Um, you know, just, just, in, just doing your normal things, just you know, me sitting in this chair, my, my body is burning, burning calories, just sitting here. Now, obviously I'm just waving my hands around and, chatting but i mean just just naturally you know while i'm breathing you need more fats um it, it's just it's just trying to find the the right balance um you know i mean here's the thing your body your body burns fat and your body burns carbohydrates protein protein you know it, your body doesn't use protein for energy it's just for repairing, you know? Um, so it's just kind of trying to find the right, the right mesh, the right match. But, 
Um, I, I really enjoy Scotty K fitness. Um, I, I've come across him here recently on TikTok. Um, his videos are, you know, I, he, they're, they're very, he's very entertaining. He's a great content creator. Um, but uh, like I said, pro, your protein is not uh, your, it, a source of energy for your body to burn. It's, it's the carbohydrates and the fats. Um, you know, that's why uh, the keto diet, you know, once you get on the keto diet, if, if you get off the keto diet, your, your body completely flips. But I mean, once, once you do keto and you stick with it and you stick with it, you stick with it, your body is continually using fat as a fuel source, obviously because your body is not putting many carbohydrates in it. So it goes to fat and it's using the fat as, as energy. Um, but you know, the, 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 the carbohydrates, you know, those, you know, that's, that's typically where you're, uh, do you record your workouts? I have started to Tanga. Um, just this week I have started to, um, I have, um, actually been live streaming them and then I will just, um, uh, export those VODs to YouTube. So I have been, um, this is the first night I've actually, um, uh, really live streamed here on TikTok, but it's post workout. I, I don't have it set up where I can do it from my phone yet, and I don't have, I don't have the equipment I need to be able to do both platforms. Um, but uh, yeah, like I said, the Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday this week, I've live streamed my workouts on Twitch, and then I just export those vods over to YouTube. Um, when I get done. So, but, uh, how are you doing Tanga? How you been? Uh, I'm trying to start working out again, but I'm very limited because, because of your back. Um, and, and that's something that I'm trying to learn more about as well. Um, you know, just, just the body in general, the body in general is, is truly an amazing thing. Um, but, uh, but, but there is, I mean, if you have a, a, a problem with, you know, with your back, I mean, there's a, you kind of, kind of want to check with, with people, you know, that are specialized in those areas to make sure that you, you know, you know, what you should avoid and what you, um, can try to do to, to, you know, not be so restricted. So I want to figure out how to tone back up while being restricted to move left or right. Um, at it's a little bit out of my scope of knowledge to give really any uh, any insight on that. I really don't know. Um but I can try to find some info. Uh, Galvatron, do you think it will be beneficial to bring protein shakes when I walk golf courses? Um, I don't necessarily see why it would be, wouldn't be beneficial. Um, you know, because uh, I, I mean, I, do you are you walking them as a like you're playing golf, or you're just walking them as a form of you know exercise because of the train? Because you know the, the golf course, they you know they go up and down, in and out, um, and all that stuff. Uh, Galvatron, do you think? I mean, are you just are you just kind of walking the course to walk it? I drink a ton of water too. I'm playing too, but I, uh, just to be walking out there, no carts. Um, but yeah, it's chaos would ask, are you, you're, you're walking while playing? Or are you riding in a cart? So are you do you're carrying your bag? Um, or are you just, uh, um, use a pull along cart? Um, I have a push cart. Okay, I got you. I I don't. I mean, I wouldn't see why. I mean, because you're you're obviously exerting force. Um, you know, while you're out there on the course, 
you know, and then obviously you're playing golf, you know, you're golfing. So, you, I mean, you're using muscles. I don't see a reason why it wouldn't be beneficial to have one. You know, if, if you play 18 holes, um, for using no carts, then protein would help because you're replacing it. Right. Like I said, I mean, you know, if you're playing 18 holes, you know, maybe after you, you play the front nine, you know, why not have one? Um, just to kind of get that into your system to start repairing. Um, you know, because like I said, you're, you're obviously using, you're, you're using your body, you're using your muscles to ultimately, uh, well, while you're golfing, you know, nonstop. I mean, there's no reason not to, um, in everything. And then, you know, it, it, there's nothing wrong with having, you know, some type of, uh, you know granola bar something something either carby you know so that you can you know replace that energy as well you know and it's uh that'd be good as a sort of a half leg day well again yeah i mean walking a golf course i mean pushing you using the push cart what's your thoughts on creatine um so, I mean, I use it regularly, every day, Tanga, every day I, I use creatine. I have um, a brand's called Concrete. Um, I found it at Walmart. Um, it's a lemon-lime flavor. I, I, I really like it. I use it daily. Um, it's, it's, it's one of the most researched supplements out there. Um, and it's shown to, um, you know, it's shown a lot of a lot of benefits um it's uh it mixes really well um but uh i mean it's it like i said it, it's one of the most researched products out there creatine is it's shown lots of promise lots of you know positives um you know like i said i use it daily absolutely i do um you know, but no, I, I creatine, I think you spelled it. You spelled it correctly, I believe. Um, but like I said, concrete, it, like I said, it's something that I found at Walmart a little while back. And I've just, uh, it seemed, the price seems reasonable. Um, I'm not quite sure how to help you with that. All right. Thank you. Um, but uh, like I said, the price is reasonable. I, I enjoy, the flavor is good. I can kind of mix it with anything I actually I typically what I'll do is I'll mix it with my uh um rocket pop um BCAAs does it help with toning and the stuff that says I can't remember it um I mean so the goal of it is is that it pulls water and it's supposed to pull water into your muscles um to obviously keep them you know hydrated but it also does obviously cause you to hold more water weight that way but um you know like i said there's a lot it's it's literally the most researched supplement um out there um and, and it shows a lot of benefits it, it it really truly does but at the end of the day obviously you know supplements you, you got to check with you know everybody everybody's bodies are different um whether they can you know have them sustain them whether they should i mean that's ultimately up to a, a, a your your primary health physician you know that's that's always a good question for them if you should use it or shouldn't use it um but that is literally the most researched supplement and there's been lots and lots and lots of research regarding it um so Be right back. I need to find this one. No problem. No problem. Okay. Let's see here. Um, I'll say boss fight until after the ad break. So I think what we're going to do, guys, um, is I'm going to wrap things up for the night. Um. If you don't, which I don't really have, I mean, I don't have like commands and stuff set up over here on TikTok because I didn't really know how it was going to go, right? Um, this is, this is, 
extremely trial and error over on the TikTok side of it. Um, I, I'm going to try to learn and hopefully get, uh, maybe get better with it um, and, and try to figure out this TikTok studio so that I can make it a bit better. Um, but uh, those of you over here on the Twitch side, you know, I, I, I probably don't have all the answers to your questions um as i'm still like i said i'm still gaining knowledge it's nitro something mm, not quite sure which one uh, i need to uh all right we're gonna close up amazon for the night here um like i said I, i'm still trying to learn a lot on the uh, nutrition side the fitness side um strength and conditioning um and get more comfortable with a lot of this um i haven't researched a lot of supplements i just know that there's a there, there's just a couple that i do use i'm trying to think nitro are you thinking more of maybe like nitric oxide i know that's a i know that's a kind of a popular one that's um supposed to be good for heart health and natural energy it's made from beets hmm. Let me, uh, nitro, um, heart health made from beets, natural energy. I'll, uh, let me, uh, I should have, I'll have, actually, I know I'm going to have a lot of downtime at work tomorrow. Um, you know, maybe I can look and research and try to find, find what we're looking for here. Um, thank you, SiriBot, for spam detection. No idea what that message was going to be, but SiriBot's doing SiriBot things. Um, but uh, like I said, I, I, I'm still trying to gain as much. Please do, if you have the name, I'll send it to you. I... I I have the name also. Yeah, absolutely. Um, you can send it to me in a message, um, or on, uh, I think we follow each other on X or Twitter. You can send it through a DM, whatever, but yeah, I mean, if you can get me the exact name, I'll try to look into it and see if I can find out some information about it and find out maybe the pros and cons just for you to kind of get a general idea, um, on, 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 if it's something that you should, you know, look into using, I mean, I can't necessarily, I, I can't necessarily recommend them, but like I said, I'll try to do what I can for research to, to show you what, what they say benefits are and, and what the, you know, cons are. Um, and, and like I said, I'll, I'll try to do what I can to help. So, um, but like I said, if anybody has questions, feel free to reach out. Um, for those of you, like I said, I don't have commands set up over here on TikTok or like that, but those of you on Twitch, you can find all my socials in one convenient spot. Um, Discord user, feel free to pop on in. Um, like I said, I, I'm still learning, still trying, figure stuff out, but I, I'd be happy to try and assist. So You can probably find better research than I can. I just read reviews and don't know the half are. If half a I mean, and that's the thing. Like that's that that's kind of why I've um wanted to try to gain more knowledge because there is so much stuff here that you could you can that that's on the internet, and and I myself didn't know if it was if it was something real or if it's just you know false information. Um. You know, and that and that's where I wanted to try to start to okay maybe if i can learn the basics what i need to look for um you know and then and then kind of start learning from there i mean that that that's kind of why i want to do why i've changed what my content is from from gaming you know to this one i i i've really enjoyed the nutrition part of what i'm doing for my my diet i've really enjoyed getting back into working out and, and fitness. 
and um, I want to learn and then I want to be able to share because I, I just, you know, I, I want people to be able to live free and live happy and, and, and enjoy, enjoy life. And if, if there's a way that I can, if I can, you know, share information that is beneficial to making your lifestyle healthier and happier, I think, I think that's, uh, you know, a way to, 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 to do it, you know. But um, like I said, I, it's it's eleven fifty five for me. I think I'm gonna uh, go ahead and wrap some wrap stuff up here. Um, those of you here on Twitch, I'm gonna send you. Oh, actually, I'm not gonna send you to Funkified. He is not on anymore. Uh, I gotta find somewhere to send you to. Hopefully, here in a moment. Um, I gotta figure that one out. I'm not quite sure where we're gonna go. Let me uh, pop open the Discord button here. Hey, yeah, I hit the hey. But no, Tang, I appreciate it. I'll, I'll see what I can do finding about this nitro um, that's good for heart health and natural energy and made from beets. So I'll, I'll see what I can find out. But yeah, if you find out the name, send it to me some way, somewhere, somehow. Um, you know, if, if you find it here on TikTok, send it through a message. If you find it on x send it through x um or whichever i'm not sure or you might be able to find me through discord i i, I don't know but you know if you like I said if you find it let me know and I'll, I'll try to i'll try to figure out what i can do to research it so um i don't think dova is still on anymore either no all right but um those of you over here on tiktok thank you for coming out um like i said i didn't quite know how these streams would go Still learning how to, still kind of learning the ins and outs of it. Uh, I'm really just learning any of it at all, but um, it seems to go fairly well. Um, I'm hoping that I can push this thing a little bit further here and build this on TikTok and everything. But um, thank you, everybody who came out. Tang, I'll see what I can do about finding you some info. I appreciate you all. TikTok, I'm going to finish things up here and I'm going to wrap things up here on Twitch. So, TikTok, we'll see you later. All right, um, all of my friends and, and, and followers over here on TikTok, we are done. Every, all my friends and followers here on Twitch, TikTok's over. Anyways, um, guys, I'm going to find somewhere to send you guys. Uh, I don't believe I have. Um, I'm not sure. Oh, paranormal. Paranormal Cost is not online. I was going to try to find a small streamer support person. I was going to send you guys the Funkified, but he just uh, he just raided out. So now I'm kind of looking for somewhere to go. Um, not quite sure who we have in here or where we want to uh, head over to. Um... Trying to find Let's see if I can find somebody. Don't believe there's anybody in my server that's live. Funkify just got off. Not online. Small streamers, nobody is live. Um, Dova just got offline. Funkified just got offline. Man, I stayed on just a little too long. No, actually, I, I I'm not gonna say anything bad about that. I I enjoy doing this. Um, it's all, I'm doing pretty well with it. So, if you need someone, I know Nestle. She was here. Yeah, perfect. Um, absolutely. Let's uh. Let's 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 do that. Let's do that. Let me find. Nestle XO. 
All right, that's what we're going to do. Um, again, guys, you can find all the links to my socials in one convenient spot right there. And then um, this live stream will be uploaded to TikTok tonight. Um, so if you missed any of it, you can check there or you can check out the Twitch VOD, I suppose. Um, FYI, your, the, the music, sound alerts, all that stuff, you won't hear those because those are not part of the VOD tracks anymore. Because I'm tired of... Uh, I'm, I don't get copyright strikes, but I get the copyright notifications and it makes me angry. So, uh, But wrap things up. I will not be on... Um, Friday night, I don't believe. Don't know what the plan is Saturday. Maybe we'll do something on Sunday. Uh, but we are going to go over to Nestle, uh, running some Fortnite this evening. Um, who came over with, uh, Galvatron's raid earlier. So we will, uh, we're going to send some love over that way. Cause, uh, Nestle has been live for 37 minutes. So let's head on over there. I appreciate Galvatron for the recommendation and letting me know that. And that's what our plan is. So let's uh let's do that. Copy. Okay. So I'm gonna work on getting that loaded up. You guys stick around. And why did I lose my I'm not quite sure that background is out there anymore, but um, something's all weird. Anyways, stick around for the raid, guys. I appreciate you all. Have yourselves a good evening. I need to shut this camera off over here because I'm tired of looking at myself. But um, And then uh, go say hey to Nestle, and you guys all have a good night. Um, stick around for the raid. <laughs>